Hi, I'm Debbie Peverell, and you're listening to the weekly tip from Painless Financial Training Group. Today I'm talking about people who sell their businesses, and if that's you, how you should be working on some hobbies now. So, a business owner, when they decide the time has come to sell their business, there's often a sense of loss once that business is gone. And the reason for that is that they hadn't set aside some ideas around what they were going to do, they haven't worked on hobbies, they really didn't have a good picture of their retirement. I talked to lots of business owners who've retired, I talked to lots of retired people, and believe me, the tips I hear is that retirement can be really boring if you don't have hobbies that can occupy your time. So the, the business owner who is, is looking at some point to, to sell their business, they have to be thinking about what life's going to look like when they no longer have a place to go every day, when they don't have that um, you know, the to-do list full of, of things to do. And you hear, you know, Freedom 55, Freedom 65, I have some clients who are joking about Freedom 85, but the, the 55 Freedom doesn't resonate with people who are self-employed because by and large they enjoy what they're doing and they're not looking forward to retirement in the same way that someone who does not enjoy their job does. So if you're a business owner, you're thinking about selling your business sometime in the next 10 years, get to work on those hobbies.